still close in. There's Christmas decorations everywhere. So we're doing a Hot Shot Racing review. Uh, hot, this is a great arcade style racing game. It's real fun. And I'll also be including the uh, uh, boss bundle thing that came out recently. Although it really uh, is pretty similar to the what was already there. It's just a uh, set of new tracks and um, a new multiplayer mode, which I didn't get to play, and I'll explain about that later. Yeah, the cars in this game have a good sense of speed and control. They're really fun to drive. Uh, there's a lot of good car collisions. Uh, you know, it's a little sense of a rough competition. You know, there's a good boost with the good boost building system. A lot of it is based off drifting. Um, to build boosts, I kind of don't like it when uh, games are drift dependent, but I think in this case it works out. There's decent car variety, uh, there's good tracks, they're well designed, well laid out, a lot of good twists and turns and straightaways. Uh, a bit of a problem with this game is that there's no real medium. Uh, there's normal, which is the lowest difficulty, which is really more like easy, and there's next level up is hard uh, which is fairly accurate so there's no real medium in this game uh, but it is relatively still relatively fun to play on hard uh, the multiplayer is really good it's uh, fun playing gets uh, in this really hectic uh, race you know but unfortunately the multiplayer uh, player base has jungled down quite a bit uh, since launch, um, uh, maybe it will uh, spring back up with the uh, future DLCs are supposed to come out. Uh, so it's something to think about. This game does actually have a little bit of story. It's a sort of small uh, fighting game element, story element type deal uh, with these characters. Um, and there's a uh, characters that are pretty decent and interesting. Uh, the stakes are really good when it comes to color and theme. Uh, but personally, I don't think the polygonal th uh, aspect works out, except for in the design of the cars. And I don't really think it fits in as a look emulating older games because it really feels more like a modern version of polygonal. Uh, but the tracks are these great global uh, geographic locations and these interesting environments. The classic uh, desert to uh, snow jungle type thing, sort of like the older arcade games. Uh, especially like Cruising World and the like. And there's always like a lot, of, there's always like a lot of stuff happening on the side tracks to look at. Uh, they're really good grass sticks in this game. Uh, th this game is overall really good, plays really well, looks really good, but unfortunately the content is a bit light, so you might not think the price is justifiable if you're not a uh, really good, big arcade fan. All of that being said, there's supposed to be uh, more deals in the future, uh, although I couldn't really find too much about that. Despite that, overall this is a really good game. I'm giving it a 9.01. Thank you to anyone who likes, comments, or subscribes.